How's it going out there, YouTubers? Summernext Shark here with another new video for you. So this is another movie review, and this is a movie review of the movie Joy. This is a 2015 autobiographical comedy drama. Uh, it is loosely based on the QVC queen Joy Magno. Uh, it was heavily fictionalized, the film. Uh, versus what really happened. So that was kind of a letdown. But other than that, the movie itself was really good. Uh, it had great comedy and chemistry between all the actors and actresses. Uh, very good screenplay and great direction by David O. Russell, who directed it. Uh, the film stars Jennifer Lawrence, Bradley Cooper, Diane Ladd, Virginia Madison, Robert De Niro, Edgar Ramirez, and Isabella Rossellini. Now, when I saw Isabella Rossellini in this film... I was like, wow. I was like, she looks old. I was really shocked to see how much she has aged in the last, uh, like, 10, 10 years or so. Uh, versus, you know, from a lot of the movies she did in the early 2000s. Uh, but other than that, she's still a great actress, and it was fun to see her in the film. Uh, but the film, basically, if you have not seen it, what it's about is, like I said, it's a autobiographical film supposed to be about Joy Magano, who, like I said, is the QVC queen. She made the uh, ringing mop. She's invented a whole bunch of things and has made this giant empire out of nothing. Uh, and basically the movie chronicalizes her having to deal with her family and starting this business. Like I said, it was heavenly fictionalized, so a lot of what's in the film didn't really happen. Uh, other than that, though, like I said, the film is great. It was nice to watch. It was very enjoyable. Uh, it's not something I would technically add to my collection. Uh, but the acting by everyone involved was really great. Uh, Robert Darrell was amazing. Isabel Rossellini was amazing. Uh, Edgar Ramirez, I haven't seen too many of his films, but he was decent in the film. Uh, of course, Jennifer Lawrence was great, and so was Bradley Cooper. Uh, I honestly don't know why Jennifer Lawrence got nominated for an Academy again for this role. Um, unfortunately, I feel that Jennifer Lawrence, in pretty much majority of her movies, acts the exact same. It, it, I don't feel it's really any differentiating circumstances in any of the films she's in. I feel she's always acting pretty much the same. So, I mean, I don't... So when they nominated her for that award for this film, I was like, well, she won for Silver Linings, you know, playbook, which I totally agree she should have won. She was really good in that, but I felt that her role in this was exactly the same. So why should she be nominated again for something she already won for? But other than that, the uh, whole idea behind this movie being a biography was very interesting too, just to be and see what Joy went through to get to where she is or some of the things that, you know, were involved with her trying to become this, you know, somebody from nothing, which was a very interesting, inspiring story as well. So the film itself was just amazing all around. Uh, I give it six golden movie boxes up. I, I'm not giving it ten or seven or eight or nine because I still feel because of the lack of true fiction versus the fictionalized fiction of the film, uh, that, you know, makes me not put a higher mo Golden Movie Boxes up on it. Because I, when I'm watching a biography or a biographical type of film, I feel that it should be as true to the true nature or the story that it should be. So that's kind of what happened with this film and kind of that kind of put a damper on it for me. But... If you haven't seen it, give it a try. Check it out. It's worth the watch. Most definitely uh, check it out for your uh, movie pleasure to add it on your you know, list of films you've seen and say, yeah, I've seen that movie, and it was an okay movie. You know what I mean? So that's it for this video, people. I hope you enjoyed. As always, please like, subscribe, share. Always keep your eyes out for any new or older videos you might have not seen yet, and we'll check in on the next one.